Tomb Raider. Tomb Raider for PS4. Uh, I don't know uh, so much about the story because I played Tomb Raider on on my old old. It was maybe my first PC ever, and it was oh what the fuck! It was wow, 20 years maybe ago on my PC, and it was nothing uh, like compared no to PCs like you can see nowadays. It was a really old machine, and I I was so happy that I I could run this game because not this game but the Tomb Raider one I think, uh, but because it was so hard for the machine uh, to run it. But yeah, I, I I could play it, but I don't know what happened with that. I don't know. But uh, then uh, Tomb Raider Rise of the Tomb Raider uh, released, and uh, I decided to. To buy it, so yeah, I got this. Ooh, it's so much. I don't know, uh, and it, this is only like the physical copy of the games, but uh, I got the I got the games on, on Steam. I got the games on the Epic Games. I got a on what else? What platform? Uh, what is that? What else is that? Uh, uh, I don't know. It's nothing important. But what the fuck? Where, where is the crisis? I don't know. I don't remember the name. Okay, whatever. What else? Alien Isolation. So uh, another horror game, and I don't know why I buying this stuff because I really don't like to uh, if fear some things, and I really don't like to uh, put myself into this position that I'm really scared. And uh, yeah, but I, I just bought it again against my bill. <laughs> And yeah, so maybe one day I will, I will, why it's so huge? Whoa. Okay, I don't, I don't get it because it's so, so thick. What? Okay, so Alien Isolation, uh, it's kind of a game that you have to, you have to run, you have to hide, it's uh, like uh, Tom and Jerry, uh, so I don't know, the cat and mouse games, maybe it's good, but I don't know. Okay, uh, one of my most favorite again, it's a Metro, uh, I finish, I play the Metro 2033, the first one, the original version. Okay, I'm so thirsty, why is that? Because I'm, I'm talking too much to you. Mm. Okay, so uh, it was a really nice game. Uh, the Redux is uh, includes uh, the new one, the Metro, the last night, I think, and it's some sort of remaster uh, uh, of Metro 2033. I, 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 I'm not really sure about this, so uh, don't believe me, okay? <laughs> I don't know. So, but yeah, uh, I'm pretty sure I'm gonna finish the Metro. Last light because I really like the story of the original Metro. So yeah, one day. Okay, what else? Uh, South Park and the uh, Stick of the Truth. So funny game, a cartoon game. Uh, no way that I'm not gonna like it. But actually, it, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what to say because I haven't finished any of this so it's kind of really weird to say with every game that I don't know why I haven't finished this because I um, I don't know but uh, I'm pretty sure it was some good reason that I haven't finished it <laughs> okay anyways the really good game funny game okay what else oh my gosh masterpiece again some sort of uh, good collection I think it's a not collector edition but it's uh, something really, really close to that, and it's Life is Strange. What else? What else do I have? So, I got the, what is this? Soundtrack, or oh, what? Yeah, soundtrack, CD, I don't know where should I put it because I don't have a, you know, the DVD, and I don't know, and CD. Okay, uh, why am I holding this? 
Uh, what is this? Art book or what? Yeah. I think, yeah. Well, I'm sorry. <laughs> Just. It's really nice. Nice, mate. Okay. This game is about some girl, and you you make some decision, and it's uh, really similar uh, to the to the to the to the Detroit or to Heavy Rain because you make some decisions. And for me, it's really tempting to have this game and uh, never try it because I think it's really unique and it's really good. Uh, because a lot of my friends uh, talk to talk about this game, and I think. Uh, it's gonna be pretty mind blown for me, and I have to try this because I I love when you can make your character uh, on the way how you like it, or you can change your story, and then you got the completely different ending like your friend. I think it's amazing because uh, it must be so hard to do this game in this way that you have I don't know variation of your ending. So yeah, really good game, I should give it a try, so I should maybe order, I, I, maybe I should order the games for, on the, on the, on base on the priorities or maybe, what the fuck, I can't put it in, okay, it sounds weird, sorry, okay, and it's, that's it. Okay, what else? We got Diablo, uh, it's Diablo 3, and it's uh, something, you know, special edition, I would say, I don't know. Oh, well, maybe it's a normal, but it got really lovely cover, and inside, in the case, you can see... Uh, yeah, so, when I was a child, I played Diablo really often, and really... I, I really enjoy it and I finish many times actually Diablo 1 and Diablo 2 and I I, I really like it but uh, yeah so this one I never I never tried it's uh I don't know it's Diablo 3 yeah so uh, I got also with the DLC uh, it's called the Reaper of Souls. I should play this because I think it's a massive. So I should maybe order all of these games from from the bottom to the top, on based on my some sort of priority, and then I should play one by one, and maybe one day I will finish every of these. <laughs> I don't know. I I don't know. Maybe. Okay, Uncharted. On this only the the box, the special box for some sort of like limited edition. I also got a limited edition of PS4, but I'm not gonna show you because I don't know where is it. And it's um, it's it's really you know you got the art on the PS4, uh, Nathan Drake, and something else. You know the Uncharted edition PS4. You can Google it if you want. Uh, Siberia, uh, this game. Wow, I also play. I think I play this game when I was, oh my gosh, really, really young, I don't know, 10, maybe, around 10, I think, and I finished the Siberia 1 and 2, and the story, it's, it was spectacular, it was, uh, uh, it was awesome, and then Siberia 3 was released, maybe, I don't know, a few years ago, correct me if I'm wrong, but, uh, yeah, I thought to myself that I have to finish it because when I was child I really like it but uh, you know nowadays I don't know I it's not my priority it's not the, my, on the list of my priority so I don't know but uh, I, I'm pretty sure it's gonna be really good but uh, I would like to play uh, Siberia 1 and 2 again of course because I don't remember uh, anything from from that so yeah Assassin's Creed again we were talking about this Syndicate, the cover looks lovely. I would like to try it immediately, <laughs> just right now, but I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Okay, uh, The Witcher, I got uh, in the uh, discovering my language, so you, 
I, I, I'm pretty sure you're not gonna understand this, but it's a Witcher, I don't, I'm not lying to you, so... Uh, it, it, was, it was really huge for... Uh, for the storage, I think. Because I got... How many this guy have? 3, 4, 5, 6! Six cities, so oh my gosh, a lot of, a lot of storage, uh, cause a lot of storage. But uh, the graphics, I think one of the best graphics uh, in, uh, you know, the decade, I think. Okay, uh, and the story is also good. I played Witcher two, maybe I don't know, one hour, and Witcher one, two hours. Yeah, on my old PC.